Hi, uh, good morning. The topic is BAGF, AAGF, LGTFC, DG Shipping Exit Exam Question and Answer. This is related to your IGF, International Classified Fuel Ships, also for gas tanker vessels, LPG vessels, LNG vessels, basics. The questions which is recently they are asking in exit exam okay we will proceed with the system of questions starts with first question the purpose of remotely controlled measuring of tank levels are measured options are a height from liquid surface to stop top stringers in the tank option b height of liquid in the tank Option C, height from bottom shell to top stringers in the tank. Option D, height of bottom girders in the tank. Answer is B, height of liquid in the tank. One of the following is not an alarm on an inert gas plant. Which one? Option A, low pressure alarm. Option B, Low oxygen alarm. Option C. Deck seal low water alarm. Option D. Scrubber high water level alarm. Answer is option B. Low oxygen alarm. Question number 3. While commencement of loading, cargo direct high pressure loading is advisable. Is it true or false? Option B. It's false. On all gas ships, any pipe work entering or leaving the cargo tank must do so through the dash of the tank. It should be options are at the end, option B, top, option C, bottom, option D, forward, end. Answer is top. If a centrifugal pump operating with a positive suction head, is a NPSH and positive suction head becomes air bound. Your first response should be to option A bend the casting, option B tighten the packing, option C close the discharge, option D de prime the pump. Answer is bend the casting. Okay. How much cleaner is natural gas to burn? Option A, reducing carbon dioxide emission by 20% to 30%. B, reducing carbon monoxide emission up to 75%. Option C, reducing nitrous oxide emission by approximately 50%. Option D, all the above. Option is A, reducing carbon dioxide emission by 20 to 30%. When you are using cleaner natural gas, that is LNG gas. Question number seven: Self-contained breathing apparatus (SCBA) is also called as option A, compressed air breathing apparatus (CABA). Option B, EEBD. It's also called as emergency escape breathing device. Option C, ELSA. Option D, none of the above. Option A is CBA is also called as compressed air breathing apparatus CABA. The space enclosed by sieve structure in which cargo containment system is situated called Option A hold space, Option B compressor room, Option C motor room, Option D engine room. Answer is hold space, Option A. Is the space where we carry the cargo. The liquefied gas is normally carried in its fully refrigerated condition at its atmospheric boiling point of 104 degrees Celsius. That is fully refrigerated, you are not pressurizing, you are carrying at atmospheric pressure. Options are A. Ethylene, option B. Propane, option C. Butane, option D. Ammonia. The answer is ethylene, option A. How is cooling 
cleaning water supply to the inert gas carbon tower IG tower. Option A by the main seawater pumps. Option B by the cargo condenser pump. Option C by the scrubber seawater pump. Option D by the deck seal seawater pump. Option C is correct by the scrubber seawater pump. It is a separate pump which is supplying to IG system to the IG tower. Which safety device is fitted on the tank? Sorry, which safety device is fitted on the dip inert as line to monitor the supply condition of the inert gas? Options are option A, the inert gas high temperature alarm, option B, the inert gas low flow alarm, option C, the inert gas low pressure alarm, option D, the inert gas reverse flow alarm. Answer is option C, the inert gas low pressure alarm. If the tank pressure goes down or your IG line trip, everything happens. If it is IG is not coming to the tank, we can identify by IG low pressure alarm. It will lead to cause stopping of cargo operation because no inert gas there is a chance of fire. Question number 12. Tank relief valve used for release of excessive pressure. Yes, true. Option B. False. Answer is option A. True. What characteristics? Should insulation material possess for use in gas carrier? Option A. Low thermal conductivity, ability to bear load. Option B. Ability to withstand mechanical damage, lightweight. C. Unaffected by cargo liquid or vapor. Option D. All of the above. Answer is all of the above. It should be thermal conductivity and also should be lightweight and also should not cause any damage by your cargo that is LPG LNG. Which of the following is ultimate source of energy for us? Option A LNG, Option B nuclear, Option C solar, Option D CNG natural gas. Okay, answer is solar. Solar is a sun power, sunlight we will get everywhere in the world. So that is the ultimate source of energy for us. From solar energy, we can create electrical powers and other energy sources. Why strainers are commonly installed in the cargo piping systems? Option A to protect the cargo handling plant. Option B to protect equipment from the damage by foreign objects. Option C both A and B. Option D none of the above. Answer is option C both A and B. It will protect the cargo handling plant. And also protect the equipment from the damage by foreign objects. Question number 16. Which of the would you consider essential equipment to carry when working on deck of ship carrying ammonia? Option A. Gloves. Option B. Personal meter. Option C. Gas mask. Option D. Personal hydrocarbon alarm. Answer is gas mask. We should carry gas mask. Because ammonia is toxic. What is the condition of inert gas as it is produced by the boiler or inert gas generator? Option A free of oxygen and clean. Option B hot and containing soot particle. Option C 30 and saturated. Option D superheated and black or grayish in color. Option A free of oxygen and clean. Inert gas should be free of oxygen and it should be clean. If it is dirty, it will damage your cargo. Cargo will get polluted, contaminated. Okay. If there is oxygen, there is a chance of fire. We are putting IG to remove the oxygen, keep the cargo below the flow flame limit in order to prevent any fire hazard. Question number 18. For what reason cargo sampling is necessary in gas tanker? Option A to establish safe condition prior to cargo transfer. Option B to establish the cargo is within commercially agreed specification at various pumps. Option C both A and B. Option D none of the above. Answer is both A and B. The reason for cargo sampling is in gas tanker is to establish safe condition prior to cargo transfer. Because we have to know that sample what they provided is as per your spec. If it is very, we are going to 
have as well as chances of fire, chances of uh, toxic gas release. Okay, and to establish the cargo is with the commercially approved specification and various forms. Yes, we have to cross check with the spirit. Question number 19. What is the main danger to be guarded against when discharging using a cargo heater with seawater as a heating medium? Option A. Over pressuring of the gas side of the heater. B. Freezing of the water side of the heater. C. Over pressurizing of water side of the heater. Option D. Overheating of the gas side of the heater. Uh, answer is B. Freezing of the water side of the heater. So, so sea water we are using as a heating medium to heat the cargo. So, freezing of the water side of the heater. Question number 20. What is the magnesium, titanium, lithium, potassium are classified as it is classified as class B fires. Option A, class A fire. Option B, class B fire. Option C, class C fire. Option D, class B fire. Answer is class B fire. Class A fire is general fire. Class B, B fire is liquid fire. Class C fire is can be electrical fires. Gaseous fires. Gaseous fire. Class B is metal fire. So magnesium, titanium, lithium, potassium, sir. From the class D fair. Okay, thank you guys. Hopefully, this question will be helpful to you. Please like, subscribe my channel. I will keep updating the questions which are related to exit exam. If possible of giving explanation, if anything wrong, I kindly request to put it in the comments so I will correct and re, re appropriate the video for you guys. Thank you.